last night we had something crazy happen. Uh, I was running field to field and you guys can see it out there, but the 8RT, I was going, we have this little muddy path and I was going through it and I see the front head, cause it was, it was completely dark out and I see the front headlights just dip down. And then I'm like, all of a sudden I'm just stuck. I am just buried in a sinkhole. The 8RT hit a sinkhole and she sunk. Hey buddy, you think you can pull me out? But I'm gonna feed buddy. Uh, so you can come eat and then uh, and then we got to go pull that out But first I just told Jake I'd get seed or I'd grab seed from him So we got to run to the co-op and grab seed buddy's chowing down on some there he goes Okay, he's good. Uh, but anyways, we got to go grab seed. There's a lot of stuff we got to get doing I apologize. I haven't been uploading as much lately finals tests, but right now I am driving out holy branch to the face I'm driving out to show you guys what happened we got the old pioneer legendary reliable Honda So this is our little road here it's kind of muddy. It's always wet, but it hasn't rained lately. It's been dry. Things have been dry. So there's really no mud puddles on here. I mean, it is. She is a little muddy, I guess. But usually there's a ton more mud than there is now. So this is what happened. I have no idea how we're going to get this 8RT AD out of here. I have no idea. I don't know if I'm going to pull it. There's a hitch there. We could, what, I, what I'm thinking about doing is coming with a skid loader or dozer or borrowing somebody's skid loader or dozer and, and digging this out and then pulling from the front. Rather then pulling from the back. One thing we could do is just detach, because the planter's just right here. I could detach the planter, and then we could drag the planter around and then pull it from the back, and it would pull right out probably. Uh, but right now, the way these two tracks operate, they, like, check this out. Here, I'll, I'll even get in it. Absolutely nothing. One track is spinning, the other isn't. I can't get them to go. Let's see, I can maybe get this track to go. Come on, it's just messed up. If we had a quad track or something, or a four track tractor, we get it out of here. But it, right now, it's just stuck in there. And I know that was kind of hard on it. Just firing it up quick and just yanking those those tracks. But we're going to get this thing out of here. So for now, I'm going to drive back. And then we're going to get in the F450. Go pick up the seed tender. I know. I said I was, I I was going to go grab it. So we're going to grab that seed tender. And then come back and pull out that tractor. By the way, guys, if you enjoyed the video, smash that like button. And then my goal is... To get planted. I need to get planted. Holy crap, she is dirty. Okay, we need to wash her off quick. Just a quick spray down. Just get that windshield and stuff cleared. I don't even have to get it perfect. Just get some of the mud off. Clean off the mud flaps. There we go. Get that forward shine of Okay, we're good. Let's hit the road. Dude, I gotta figure out how I'm gonna pull out that planter. Uh, that's one thing. I'm gonna ask Jake to see if he can come over. Right now, Austin's busy. He hasn't been a reliable farmhand for a while, so it's only me. Like, I, I need help right now. So I'm going to ask Jake to help me. That should We should be covered there. And then also, one other thing is you guys might notice some lag in my game. A couple of people have commented on this. This is not because of the PC. It's because of the server. Right now, we're on a server that's hosted in the magical internet space, and we have tons of mods on here. So at some point, it can't handle the mods, and it creates a lag for everybody on here. So that's one of the downfalls of having a server just want to state that because some of you guys are noticing it hey there's jake jake how you doing brother hey jake how you doing oh uh, not so bad what about you good uh, well good my tractor's not doing good but i'm doing i'm doing decent i guess i got my what? 8rt just buried in one of my side roads it, i hit a sinkhole uh, and that thing really? was just gone and you well i guess it's the one you sold to me and you know two track tractors they're tough to get out of a <laughs> mud hole yeah dude that sucks uh i mean if you want i can help you with that today you need someone to help you to get that out or well jake i was gonna ask you would want to help me get my tractor completely out of this mud and it's gonna take a couple hours if you got time that'd be awesome yeah i've got time I hired, you, uh, I hired someone out to get some planting done in my field so i don't have to worry about it so okay that works okay. for me oh there's he he's going what is that an 8r 9r 8r yeah. Okay. okay. Um, do you have the goodies? The seed? Yes. Yeah, if you want to just follow me, I'll, I'll guide you back okay. to where it is. It's already loaded up. Okay. So we're picking up seed, specifically corn seed right now from Jake. He should. He said he had it loaded up on seed tender, so we'll just hook up to it right here. Keep coming? Yep. Keep it coming. Okay. Keep coming. Keep coming and ho. Good? Yep. Okay. Crank her down. Gotcha. There All we right. go. She's on. Perfect. You should be uh, good to go. The remote is on it. Um, you've operated these before, right? Yep, yep. I ran one of these. Okay. I got to get used to it, though. Last time I uh, just about smacked Austin in the face with it. Almost knocked him out when I was open. <laughs> uh, when I was open. Yeah, it was bad. Uh, yeah, that would have uh, been 
an interesting story to tell. Susan would have been mad at me. Um, okay, well, if you have any issues with it, just let me know. But are you heading over to your uh, your tractor right now or later? Yeah, no, I'm heading over right now because that's my planter tractor. So I got to get that thing out, and I got my my planter still hooked up to it. So somehow I got to get that out too. So. Okay. Um, should I just run over in my pickup here, or should I bring like my nine RT? How stuck is it? I got my quad. I got my quad track there that'll pull it out. So we should be good with that. So if you want to bring, just bring your pickup. Yeah. Okay. And then I got a right. ah, shoot. I don't have a chain. I have a winch, but I don't think the winch is gonna hold up. So I'm, I'm thinking we're gonna need a chain. Do you have a chain at all? I guess I don't even yeah. have one on the farm. Yeah, I got one in the toolbox and or in the bed of the truck. So okay. I'll just bring that. Okay, that'll be perfect. That'll be perfect. Then we'll pull her out. I don't know with a quad track or something. We'll figure it out. All right. Well, I'll just follow you over there then. Okay. Time four. I'll see you there. All right. Free seed, right? <laughs> yeah, sure. It's free now, but... baby. <laughs> Jake, I'm buying you a six pack. What do you want? Ooh, uh, bush, uh, bush latte. Bush lattes. Okay. Yeah. I'll get her. Appreciate it. Six bush lattes to you, sir. All right. Thank you. I'll put that in the bed of the truck and. Uh, well, if uh, if it takes longer, I'll have to go back and get some more for you, man. Because <laughs> I right. I really appreciate you helping me with this. If we get it, I guess if we get it out today, hopefully we can get it out today. Hopefully, mean hopefully. you can get it out today. But you need fuel in that pickup, Jake? No, no, I'm okay. good. I was gonna say, I'll top her off. <laughs> oh, that's all right. The uh, the co-op pays for the fuel on that thing, anyway. Oh, okay. So. Okay. Well, stop on by my place and I'll wash her off once we get done too. <laughs> all right. Sounds like a plan. Okay. Yo, who's that? Who is that? <laughs> I didn't even know who that was. I have, dude, I have no idea who that guy was. Honestly, I have no idea who that guy was. But we're going. We're heading back there. Jake should be behind me. Oh, shoot, dude. I accidentally sat on the remote. My pipe is out. My pipe is out right now, dude. Oh, man. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's, uh, what button is it? Okay. There we go. That should be better. So I think Jake stopped and uh, picked up the chain from one of his buddies because his buddy was borrowing it. So what I'm going to do is get the quad track out and probably try... Quad track or 8970? I think... Huh. Okay, we're going to get the quad track out. I'm going to use a quad track. It, it's it's a toss-up. We could use 8970. We could use a quad track. I'm just going to use a quad track for now. I know Case H fans are going to say something about the case pulling out the deer, but we got to do it. Plus, we're not going to use this disc anymore. And we're probably going to use a cultivator anymore, so I don't want to unhook that. The beast has woken. So I'm going to put this disc... Ah, shoot, we got to clean the disc off, but we have a specific room. We have a spe specific space back over here where I can where I can drop off implements. So that's where I'm going to put the disc. It, I don't know if it'll... Well, for now, I'm just going to hide it in the back, kind of. Because I made this room just so we can kind of hide implements from everybody. Not hide them, but if they're dirty and stuff... I just don't want implements sitting out in front of my farm. So for now, I'm just going to... There we go. We got her disconnected. Dropped her off right there. And then we'll hook the quad track up to the chain. Try to pull out that 8RT. So I think Jake's going to bring that chain on down. I think so. So I am going to take the quad track down here and get it all set up. Uh, so when Jake comes here with the chain, we're ready to rock and roll. What's that case? You think this will be an easy job? My gosh, you're cocky. Oh, just pull the deer right out of there. Whatever you say, Case. And there's Jake. That's definitely Jake. So the first step is disconnecting this. I'm going to get the hydraulics disconnected, this disconnected. It will tie a chain around the planter, drag this thing off, and then yank out this ADRT. Hopefully that's a plan. Hopefully nothing goes wrong. But as you can see, the front end is just scraping. And then the back end is just kind of messed up too. I'm pushing. I'm pushing. Come on. Come on. Come on. Give uh, her. It ain't going anywhere. <laughs> no, reverse, reverse. I'm in reverse. Dude. Oh my gosh. We got this stuck too. Uh, no, <sighs> it ain't going anywhere. Okay, shut her off. This will be easy pull out. Okay. Right. Um. Well, here. Do you want to... Okay, you, Jake, you have your chain hooked up to it. Let's just pull it out now with the quad track. And then we'll get the 8RT out later. Or after okay. it. Okay. Yeah, by the way... What? You said that you had it, like, stuck. That's buried. <laughs> <laughs> you bring your shovel? I'm tired of this, Grant. That's too bad. You keep digging. Keep coming? Yep, keep coming. Okay. Straight back, straight back. Tiny bit to your left there. 
There you go. Straight back. Keep her coming. Keep coming. Keep coming. And there we go. I got it. Okay. Hey, look uh, at that sprayer going down the road. Okay. All right. There we go. Do you want, you want me to uh, hop in and put her in neutral or what? Yeah. I mean, you can give her a little reverse, but this thing's just going to drag her out like a little baby cup. All right. I'll just make sure it's in neutral then. Okay. Yep. Radio's going. All right. We're in neutral. Okay. Here we go. Hold on. There you go. I recognize those two voices. I'm Brad, you get your dang uh, hold on. Stuck we're we're kind of in the middle of something right now, Buck. Hold on. Yeah, hold I on. Know. Did you get stuck again? Yeah, we got her stuck. And Jake, Jake got his truck stuck. On. Okay, I'm going to drag Jake out. Holy cow. Okay. You good, Jake? There we go. Yeah. Yeah, we're plenty good. Okay. I'll disconnect her. Got her pulled out. Now, I'm thinking with the deer and the planter, we'll detach the planter and then drag the planter to the side. And then what we'll do is hook up the chain to the rear of the 8RT. And it should pull out that's the way. We'll just reverse it out. Okay. So you just want to uh, chain to the planter, get the planter out of the way then, and then chain up to the tractor? Yes. Yes. Yeah. All right. Well, I'm going to run over to the tractor, get the planter unhooked real quick so it's ready to go when you get over there. 10-4. Keep coming. Yep. Bring her back. Keep on coming back. And uh, Whoa. <laughs> Okay, you got All her right. hooked up to the planter? No, hold on. Let me drag this over. There you go. Okay, I'm going to slowly make sure everything stays tight. I'm going to slowly just drag this over. The planter should come with. Maybe you got to give it a... You probably don't even touch it. Just stay out of the way, I'd say. But it'll come. All right. You ready? Gotta... There we go. Nice. She's coming. She's coming. She's coming. <laughs> she almost dipped there. Okay. That should be good. Ah, shoot. We should probably go a little more. All right. Here we go. Keep coming. Okay. I'm going to pull around to the other side of the tractor and we'll hook up to her. All righty. Hey, Buck, you there on the CB? 10 4, bud. You want to come over and watch? We got beer. Jake will share with you. Are you sure about that? Yeah. I might make a trip. I've been going back and forth lately. Got a couple things I had to pick up from the dealer. Mm. He just got shipped over from Iowa. Really? Or that, or well, I got a few things shipped over from Iowa, but a lot of the stuff is my uncle's things that he had moved to other farms at the moment, that I'm bringing back that are either being fixed or so on and so forth. It's okay. Quite a bit of a okay. Okay. So yeah, I'll make I'll make a stop. I just, I'm actually just leaving the store right now. Okay. Come on over, man. It'll do. Bring the hot dogs. Hot dogs, maybe. All right. Hey, Grant, you wanna there? I uh, you got, got her attached. Yep. Okay. Do you want to quadra case or deer? Which one? I'll hop in the deer. Okay. You know, I guess you've you've driven the 8RT before, have you? Yep. Okay. So just put her in, put her in reverse, and just slowly go. The quad track should pull her out. Hopefully. All right. And did I hear over the CB uh, bucks coming over? <laughs> yeah, bucks said he was gonna come over. Yeah. Well, do we want to wait for him? Uh, <laughs> is he gonna be soon? Then yeah, we gotta wait for to him. This. Yeah. He'll be like five minutes. We'll just wait for him. That'll be cool. I'll take some Instagram uh, photos while we're waiting. Yeah, you know what? Uh, how about a, a pre... Uh, well, that's a, that's a bad term to use. Uh, Can't drink and drive, Jake. Do. Can't drink and drive. Even if it's a uh, you know, you don't need a license to drive it. So, no, you're right. You're right. Yeah, I'm just going to snap an Instagram photo and send it to a uh, Platte Valley dealership. Show them what's happening here. The case pulling out the deer. Oh, nice. Tag them on uh, <laughs> social media, too. Yep. This is free content. No ads when you're watching a video, man. She's real life. I mean, like three quarters of your videos when I try to watch them? Oh, ho, 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 ho. <laughs> shots fired. Shots fired. <laughs> <laughs> nah, they're good content. All right, let's okay. go check him out. He's great. Uh, But yeah, we're going to pull her out. Buck, actually. Or yeah, yeah, yeah. Buck, if you just want to. Can you hold my camera while we film this? Yeah. I'll okay. get up, um, I might get a close-up shot here. I'll just kind of get right by the grill. Okay, okay. That, well, the top of the hood. Okay. Let's get her done, right, boys. Gonna, hey, there. I'm going to find my way to crawling into this thing. Luckily, the stairs aren't buried. Ooh, hang on a minute. It's kind of hard to find a spot. You get, get that. Whoa! I can't, I can't. Right back here? Yeah. There you go. Got some good shots here. Okay, is everybody ready? Yes. Okay. Hold up. You gotta turn on them caution lights. There True. we go. There you get mine going. Now I'm ready. Okay, here we go. I'm putting her in gear. We're gonna right, go. I'm in reverse. You're spinning. Come on. 
Come on. Come on, Big Bassie. Come on. We're getting there. I'm spinning. I'm literally spinning. Come on. Come on, dude. How deep are you stuck? So, we're bottomed out right now. I'm pulling. Keep going. Come on. Come on. There we go. She's pulling. She's pulling. I'm spinning. I'm literally spinning right now. Come on. Come on, this has got to be some good content. Oh, come, come on, on she's going. Close. She's going, dude. We are literally spinning the whole time. We're almost on the ground. Okay, 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 okay. We're there, we're there, we're there. Holy oh, crap. Oh my gosh, dude. I gotta tell you, you must have left a pretty good Play-Doh implement in that, implant in that uh, dirt to have this thing come out dirt-free. <laughs> Look at that shine. It's dry. I think what was happening is it, I, I got to jump under here, but I think the front end was just scraping the whole time. I think the front end was, was bottomed out. out. The weights. Well, I was driving last I night, and then I'm driving, and then I'm like, what? I don't have any lights. And I look around me, and I'm not moving. And then I look down, and I get out of the tractor, and it's boom. It's just straight into the ground. <laughs> <laughs> Must have just been a, a soft spot there. I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> I don't Sorry. know. I'm gonna have to bring the dozer in, fill that in, or excavator and kind of dig her out and get some of that out. I don't know. I don't know what's gonna happen. Yeah, but I don't know. At least the tractor's I gotta get out. stuff back to my farm, so I don't know what you guys want to do after that. But I gotta get going. Yeah, I got. Right. Hey, I got. Since you guys all helped here, I got some. And Black, you recorded. I got some deer jerky in the fridge. You guys want to go back and eat some? I mean, I'm down. Okay. Yeah, I, I'll never deny some deer jerky. Uh, I just want to make sure nothing's damaged on here real quick, though. Okay. I checked that bracket in the front with the lights. Should we uh, just hitch a ride on, with you and your tractor? Yeah, why not? We'll uh, test this baby out, make sure everything's good, make sure we're not dripping oil or something. All right, uh, I call buddy seat. Okay. Uh, <laughs> uh, Buck, okay, you can just... I guess I'll sit on the ladder. <laughs> Just yeah, yeah jump on the ladder. ladder. I'll go slow. You should be fine. Ah, uh, no, give her, give her, give her gas. You sure? Okay. Give her the he double hockey. Give her the he double hockey stick rule. <laughs> All right. Okay. Jump on in, Jake. Oh yeah, this buck. Nice Sorry, and she's a little cold. I got you. It's only sixty six out. We'll be fine. Actually, that hold on tight, Buck. Bad. We're going through. Oh. Psych. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Better not get my boots, Maddie. These things Buck, are Buck, you face plant into that dirt right there. Oh, man. Yeah, Buck. You know, you are really not a good driver. Hang on tight. Oh, I got a grip like a... Buck, fold in Jake's toe mirrors here. <laughs> fold them in. All right, hang on just like a minute. Oh, you're, you're going to hit it. All right, hang on. You got him? <clears throat> there we go. Got okay. it. All right. To the deer jerky we go. How's the AC out there, Buck? Oh, she me minty. I wonder if the cops would pull us over. Only one way to find out. <laughs> Buck, open your mouth. You might find something to eat. Ooh, them flies are beautiful. That's pretty good. <coughs> you good there, Buck? <coughs> oh, oh, I got a fly in my mouth. <coughs> <laughs> Nutrition. That, that was you your deer jerky, in. Buck. <laughs> what? That was your deer jerky. There How's we go. I got yourself. some in the fridge in the shop here. I would rather have deer jerky, not fly jerky. You got a fly on your face. Left cheek. Wipe it off. Oh, really? There you go. You got yeah. it. Okay. Huh? You got it right on your face. You know what? I was looking for a new hood ornament for uh, one of my semis. You uh, want to volunteer? How about no? <laughs> hey, what do could, I charge uh... an hourly? Yeah, you have to pay me $6 an hour. What do you pay an hourly? <laughs> oh, $6 an hour. We All got, right. We got a buck's rack on, front of my, uh, on the front of my tractor. <laughs> oh, really? Get it? Buck, it's got a. That joke's as slow as dial-up. Oh, oh, but oh, that's Buck. a slow. Jake said that a couple weeks ago. I already said I that joke. Listen to this man. Oh. <laughs> Not only is it slow as dial-up, he's copying me. Oh. <laughs> I mean, hey, I didn't get my charm from nothing. I steal it. Nope. Oop. I didn't say it. How did they taste? I have lucky charms. I eat all the rainbows. You guys want to ride back, Buck? Yeah. Buck, Buck, you can take back. the the actual seat this time. I'm good. Yep, you're just gonna. Uh, he wants to get his cardio in, I guess. Okay. We'll see you, Buck. I'll be over there in a minute. We'll race we'll you race back. We'll race you there. Buck, jump on. I got it. <laughs> nice. <laughs> nice. Are you about done over there? Here, Buck. I'll put you right on the ladder of your tractor. 
That way you don't have to walk. Well, I guess I am. Did I just hear a screw? <laughs> you did. Well, if you didn't puncture my tire with a weight, <laughs> then we'll get it. There you go. Jump on, Buck. All right, guys. Thanks for the lift and thanks for the show. Thanks for the free fly meat. We'll see you, Buck. See ya. Bye, everyone. All right, Grant. You uh, good to go here? Yeah, I'm good to go. I'll get all my equipment moved back. I appreciate the help, though. Really do. Yeah, no problem. You ever need anything, just let me know. I'm always here to help. 10-4. All right. Well, I'll see you. We'll see you later. Well... Everybody went home, and since we got the tractors out, what I'm going to do is take the case back to the shed, and then I'll have to somehow, I'll probably have to run back out here, and then get the John Deere hooked up to the planter, and then we need to get planting. It is bad. Some of our farmers already got planted, and their seed is like three weeks ahead of mine. So it's, uh, it's tough. It's fun, but it's tough. And oh shoot, Jake forgot his chain. I got his chain on the back of my quad track. I'll we'll have to give him a call. Let him grab it. Since we did get the quad track muddy, I'm gonna clean this thing off. And we should be good to go to put it in the shed. And away she goes. There we go. Not sure what we're gonna do about that. We'll figure it out later. So I have the planter jacked up again. And I'm, all I'm gonna do is back up, line her up, get out, connect her. There we go, she's hitched up, hydraulics are in. I think we're good. And so far, the tractor, it seems okay. It's not like we did scrape the bottom, but it's not like Nothing's leaking, uh, no fluids dripping. I think we're good. So what I'm doing is driving back, and then we're gonna fill this with seed, and finally start planting. After all this, we're gonna start planting. It's great. By the way, guys, seriously on a side note, um, if you guys have any recommendations on specific farming videos, farming videos specifically, I always try to have something entertaining happen with them, and then I always try to just farm and keep rolling with it. Because if I post a video that's like planting soybeans for the day it just nobody cares to watch it but if something entertaining happens on the farm uh i always i always like to do that so with that being said if you have any recommendations on crazy stuff that could happen while i'm farming to do like crazy ideas feel free to leave them down below in the comment section it's always cool listening to that so as far as tillage all of our oh shoot we better pull up a little bit all of our fields are done as far as tillage. Um, we either tilled them up or we didn't till some of them up and that was beans from last year, which is okay. We don't have to no-till on bee ground. On corn ground, I did want to till some of it up. So with that being said, all of it's done. Now the only thing we have left is to get planted. We're filling with seed. There she goes. Okay, so while that's filling, what I'm gonna do is watch it. Well, we're still rolling. Now, there may have been a part, I don't know if it happened or not. I guess if, if it happened, I'll edit this out. But there may have been a part where uh, the clip in front of this got uh, deleted and got edited um, because I've been having software issues with Farm Sim right now. But I'm going to keep complaining. I don't know how long this is going to be. We could go, I could be going all night or I could call it a night halfway through and then uh, finish and pick it up tomorrow morning. We'll see, but I'm going to try to get this knocked out here. Shouldn't be too bad. So I'll see you guys once we're done. We got her done. I am headed home. So what I did is I got about three quarters of the way. I went to bed, woke up in the morning, and then finished it. And I got to, and then I had to do the headlands. But the headlands, if you guys see here, it doesn't. It doesn't look like I did the headlands. It looks like I just ended, turned around on the road, and then went back. Obviously, there's not dirt marks all over the road. So what happens is, for some reason, Farm Sim doesn't show you did the headlands when you do it when you're going along here. It just doesn't show it. I don't know if it's the textures of the map or what though. It could just be this map that shows it just vertical like that. I have no idea. Our 8RT and planter is just dirty, dude. And it's kind of clean off as I go down the roadway. That's what's weird. Pull in here. Make sure not to take out the mailbox. We're good. So, I got to keep going on fields. Now, what we have... I'm going to pull up my iPad here. What we have is field 28 I own, which is planted as corn. Field 3 is planted as Beans. Oh, because I didn't till it up from last year. That makes sense. Um, so it still needs to be like planted actually because it was just harvested. But field 21 and 22 and then 20 need to be planted. 3, 20, 21, and 22. I should probably knock 3 out since the plant has beans. I'll put that, put that in as corn. And then field 22 and 21, I'll probably plant, put in as beans most likely. Field 20 around the farm? I don't know yet. 
So I'm pulling around. I'm going to uh, fill her back up, and then we're going to head out to field field 20 and 20. Actually, field 3. We'll head back to field 3 over there. But I'm going to take a quick nap. Anyways, guys, this is going to be the end. Hopefully, you guys did enjoy. If you did enjoy, hit the like button. We'll probably be back planting. I don't know when. We got some. I think we have something pretty special coming out tomorrow. So thanks for watching, guys. As always, hit the like button. And hey, I'll see you tomorrow. Thanks, guys.